Hi, hunkies and hunkos. So today, I'm going to be showing you my morning routine. So, let's get started. So, I um have this really nice morning routine. I use this foaming facial cleanser. I get this so my hair doesn't get wet. Just to like have a clean spot on my day. So you guys, guess what? I'm in Canada, so I'm not having so much fun. Um, next week is my last week in Canada, and um, I'm going to Canada's Wonderland, and it's gonna be so much fun. We're also going to a two-hour beach. It's so pretty, and I love it so much. So now I use my daily moisturizing lotion. I have all survey stuff. Survey, survey, survey. Sometimes I would use this, but not that much. It's just like this for different brands. It's lotion for your face. My face always be breaking out, so that's why I stopped using this. My mom's best friend in soccer gave it to me. Basically, my auntie. So yeah, I just yeah. I use this CeraVe facial moisturizing lotion with sunscreen in it. It's a stack. My mom told me to like put it up. But not too hard. I, I'm trying not to do it hard. But. So I use this for my knees and my elbows. I just use these for my knees to, um, you know, take away the bumps. These are for my, my bumps on my knees. I'm already starting to grow like hairs with bumps in it for some reason. My mom, I think it's called hairs with bumps in it or bumps with hairs in it. Yeah, like there's bumps, but hair is growing in it, I think. So. Yeah, but they did actually went away. Yeah. Like every time when, I, when I'm making up my bed, I mean when I wake up, I have to make up my bed for some reason. Like I want to be so clean for some reason. And yeah, so then I brush my teeth. But after when I brush my teeth, I'm going to be using some deodorant. So, guys, I got this cute bag. Um, I, my auntie gave it to me and um, it's really cute. I love it so much. And I literally put like everything in there. Like, boom. This is not all my jewelry. I have more, but yeah. I have deodorant and some hair stuff. <laughs> so, I have a lot of other color hair ties. But I think I want to use my purple one. On my hair because I'm wearing all purple. So let's be honest, okay? Mile is one of the best brands ever. Right here. It's curl refreshing spray. So this helps your hair refresh your curls. Because you know, like I have curly hair. So I like to put this in my hair. Sometimes I don't use it every day. Like my hair is this long, you guys. I'm just putting this all over my hair. I need help doing this. Okay, guys, so I have my auntie with me. And I'm not ready for the day, but <laughs> I'm getting your hair ready. Let's go. Yeah, so I just want to step back. Okay. And she loves water, 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 water. Sometimes you have to put a little product in there. Because water, water... Yeah, I put this. Okay, yeah, you know the thing then. Yeah, this is like to make my girls come back. Even though... Okay. I back. Let me get my phone. Beautiful as always. As always. My mom does it like the, the way that I want. Like, I mean, Julian does it, but... It's just wavy. That's why I have to do this. I don't know why the heck I'm hitting this. I'm gonna wreck up my whole hair. I'm gonna leave, so bye. I hope you had fun with my morning video. You guys, it's round two of the family reunion. We had so much fun yesterday with Slick's family. They're so fun. They remind me of my Caribbean family. I can't wait to get them together. Hey, Zane. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. I know, it's going to be hilarious because my family is so Caribbean and yours is so country. It's but be a whole it'll lot work. Of, what did you just say? Yeah. <laughs> I'm 
sorry. You said what? Right. Because the accent. What do that mean? Oh my gosh. It's like everyone's speaking English, but everyone has these strong accents. It's just so funny. Um, so now we road trip from Atlanta to Anniston, Alabama. And we're going to the family reunion. No, nobody. That's how the white people say it. What? Alabama. Okay, how do you say it? Alabama. Alabama? Alabama. Alabama. Yeah. Alabama. Alabama. So we're in Anniston, Alabama. Wait, hold on. Wait. No, Alabama. <laughs> Alabama. Yeah, Alabama. So how did I say it? You said Alabama. I know, I have to say it with an accent. Sweet home, Alabama. Alabama. Good Alabama. job, Zane. Okay, so what can we expect? Like, you know, give us the rundown. Um, you can expect to have to talk at the top of your lungs because everybody's always yelling. <laughs> Well, I mean, then I'll fit right in. I fit in last night. Mm -hmm. Right. It was so fun. Anyways. Oh, and I'm going to expect a lot of line dancing. Because I swear, we were line dancing like 50% of the time. That's because you kept playing that music. <laughs> I want to learn that one dance. How does it go again? I figured it out. How do, what's the song again? I don't even know. Ain't something. Ain't, ain't something like that. Like Anyways, it's so good. Hmm? Like, like a castle? I think that's a church. They have a lot of churches in Alabama. All right, y'all. We'll see you at the reunion. Yeah, so we here at Jess Scrambles here in Anniston, Alabama. It used to be at a house. Now it's at a food truck. Um, I grew up on these burgers. Big Mom used to... Whatever it was like food in the house that I didn't want to eat. Let's see, baby. She'd pull out a couple dollars, give me some give me some money, and be like, baby, go on here, go on down the street, get you a just scram. Oh, that's okay. Back then they were like 50 cent. Now they now they don't they don't win up. But um these are the best burgers. So wait, it's a it's scramble a, a scrambled burger. What does okay, explain what a scramble yeah, burger is. I can show you better not tell you. Scramble burgers, y'all. Okay, we'll let's we'll see. Yeah. Like what kind of meat's in it though? Beef. I seen him when I was riding bus. I seen him do it all the way back. Yeah, I had to turn around. I had to. Taking a picture of the test seat. The test seat. So wait, you haven't seen one in person before? Mm -hmm. It's my first time seeing one. First time? First time. Lit. It's a mess right now. Maybe we should clean it. <laughs> it's been my What happened? Okay, what? Show him. You just gotta have your phone. Yeah. Hey, they close the front door. They drive easy. Oh. Right? And driving by yourself. Looks like ground beef in a burger. Oh, man, but it don't taste like ground beef in a burger. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Tell the hunties what you think. Is it good? Mm. What does it taste like? Too hot. <laughs> it's spicy? It's not supposed to be spicy. That one's mild. Hmm? That was, that was not hot. It's spicy. You guys, it's a ground beef. You guys, it's a ground beef sandwich. Let me get another bite. With like, is that coleslaw? Yo, you're you're getting it all over me, Zade. <laughs> I told you it had cabbage in it. Mm-hmm. 
See, I grew up on these little sandwiches. It's good. No wonder why everybody's here. Mm -hmm. It's good. So they came to add a bumble to get these sandwiches. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's the highlight of the trip. Let me, for me. get it. Let me get the rest. Here it goes right here, y'all. There's a loose meat sandwich that he always talks about. Oh my God, there's a, there's a, ah! So, this is my grandparents' house. This is where uh, 10 kids grew up in this, in this house. Two bedrooms. Wow. Wait a minute, three bedrooms with no doors. Wow. No doors. And it used to be, it used to be a genetically modified bush right here that was designed for, for making switches to give you whoopings. You used to come here every summer? Every summer. And be playing in this ditch. And we used to, we used to, we used to crawl underneath here and be underneath there playing. We would go all the way and go. We just be under there, man. We would sit under there and be playing. In there. All day. Yep. Up and down. But and then, through it, and then we used to go all the way down. Like you it's a trail to go to one of our other cousins' houses back there. Mm -hmm. But you, what's in there? It was nothing now. And then back here was Big Daddy's uh back here was Big Daddy's junkyard, which is no junk back here no more. But this was it. Mm-hmm. So, true story. When I was a little boy, I literally blew myself up in real life playing back there. Yeah, I found a, some gasoline and kerosene, and I mixed it together, and yeah, I blew up. I was like eight years old. I'm hoping I don't step step on a snake. Yep, man, everything looks so much smaller than I remember. That's crazy. All right, it's recording. It's recording. All right. Hey, y'all. This is Fauna. And this is, who are you? Sarah. You're Sarah. Are you excited for the family reunion? Yeah, I'm ready for the food. You ready yes. for the food? Yes, we have our vloggers on deck. <laughs> y'all, go ahead. Yes, yes. All right. And you were with us yesterday, right? Yeah. Okay, so you was with us when we had the shakedown bus uh -huh. down at the house. It was, okay. It was, it was fun. Everyone's still recovering. Everyone's uh -huh. literally still recovering. Yeah. All right. And who's this lady right here? No, oh, Lord. Oh, uh, were you there yesterday? <laughs> what is that? Yeah. Ah. Hey. Who are y'all? Introduce yourself. I'm Molly. This I'm is We're twins. They're twins, y'all, and they taller than me. Look at that. Oh my goodness. They're definitely. How old are y'all? Fifteen. Me. They are fifteen. That's crazy. That's crazy. Are y'all gonna do a little meet and greet on the camera? Yeah, we're gonna do a little meet and greet. Do a little meet and greet. Do a little meet and greet. All right. And here we got the man with the plan. What's the plan? You the man with it. Hey, look, somebody walked up to me and said, Are you Earl? I said, Well, you about to serve me? <laughs> the trial time, Mr. B. All right, all right, all right. And here's Angeli. All right, where are you from? Oh, you look cute, girl. Yes, and she, she was here yesterday, y'all, in Atlanta, but she had her time. I know and that's I'm right. back to Atlanta, and I'm having another time oh. later. Mm -hmm. Where y'all gonna be at? We outside. Right, we outside. Hello. Okay. All right, this her mama. This she the birthday girl, everybody. She the birthday girl. Birthday girl. And here's Kendra. I look cute. This is Kitty. Hey, hey, cousin Ken. Cousin Ken. All right, girl, you look cute. I do. This is a good camera. It is. Hold on. Hold on. Let's take thumbnail. So this is where you add a little filter, a little pause. A little pause. So Latoya, you have to edit this. Thank you, love you. Pretty Auntie Song. Pretty Auntie Song. Oh, you look cute too. 
Is the food ready? Is the food ready? Look at the mic. Pull a mic. A mic said, Tell the people, hey. What? Tell the people, hey. I'm there getting kidnapped. Now, y'all, I'm trying to find everybody else. Hold on, because some of these people, they family, but I don't know them, so. And I think it's time to eat, so. Let's go see what the kids are doing. Look at my mommy. Hello there. I'm glad to be here. All right, thumbnail, the smother. Hi, daughter. Are Hi. we twins, y'all? Are they? I don't think so, but the people said we are. Hey! All right, thank you. So what has happened now? I've been following my girl, Latoya, for years. Ah! What you're doing one right, day. Right. And what I saw was my cousin on the thing. I got her tonight. I said, oh my God, let me call my other cousin. I said, girl. Hold <laughs> <laughs> on, let's on one of these videos with my girl. I don't understand. I didn't call an ex. Right. Because it ain't my bitch. Right, right, right. But all I know, when I saw y'all through the years, I said, aw. And now, aw. Yeah. Oh. I'm already friends with your family. Yeah, I already you know him before you knew him. Right, exactly. Yeah, they knew right. me, right? Before he knew you. Right, yeah. exactly. <laughs> Oh my gosh, y'all, I'm so excited to eat this food. This food looks so good, it tastes good. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all, not even hungry no more. Y'all, look at this food. Give me your food. I had to put my chicken on his plate, okay, because I had to make room for spaghetti. This pregnancy, I don't know what it is, but I've been loving spaghetti recently. We've been eating it quite often, huh? You've been eating it I every know. day. I know. Mm. It's so good. Anyways, y'all must eat, huh? Mm, must eat, y'all must eat. One of the honey. Hey! Oh, no! Oh! 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 Look at, look at my chick. Y'all been fine? You been playing football, y'all. I'm just washing my hair. Remember when I had that bob? Well, I had micro links in so my hair was left out, my natural hair. And I just told the hairstylist to go ahead and cut my hair. Like, I need to start caring more for my hair. So I'm gonna try to just give it a break from extensions. I want my natural curl pattern back, you know. When you flat iron your hair a lot and you put a lot of product in it, a lot of heat, your hair, well not product, but like a lot of heat and stuff, your hair gets so damaged and so I just need to start taking care of my hair and putting less heat on it. Let's see if I can actually do it and not, you know, talk about it. 
But yeah, I'm gonna grow my hair out. My hair grows pretty fast. But we'll see. All right, I'm using the rice water collection by my L. Doo -doo. The shampoo. There's hair everywhere. Look at how much hair came out. Look. Stuck between my fingers and all that. water collection by my L and it's a clay mask. You're supposed to leave it in for about 15 minutes. straight pieces you see well that's why that's why it's also getting sick because you're putting weave in your hand mommy i know and putting too much heat on it you need to leave it yes ma'am <laughs> what are you doing isn't that much wait you washed it i washed it yeah it feels so nice what are you doing today so ari is coming over and guys i've been going to camp for very long <laughs> But I took a break because, like, I just, I was tired today, and I never get to, like, sleep. I always have to be waking up at 7 to get ready and stuff, so I was taking a break. Oh, life is so hard, honey. Life is hard. <laughs> what is hard about life? What did you say? What is so hard about life? Whenever, whenever, like, you see, I just try, I'm trying to pick my... The step away that keeps falling. <laughs> so life, life, life is hard, but God is good. Yeah. Amen, sister. Okay, so I, so I started saying this every day, and I said it to Aunt Jillian, like, like I did yesterday. Yeah, I did it. Yeah, I said it to Aunt Jillian yesterday or the other day. So I said, okay, so you have to put like your own in my hand. Okay. Repeat after me. I'm strong. I am strong. I am beautiful. I am beautiful. I am blessed. I am blessed. Yes, Lord. I am courageous. I am courageous. I am powerful. I am powerful. And I love God and Jesus. And I love God and Jesus. Amen. Amen. So Candy's here. She's about to do my brows now. She's been MIA for how long? Six months. Oh, <laughs> uh, I wish I would have brought the box. Wait, I don't know what Yeah, we have to show the cute packaging. So here's the tint. Yeah, so that's, yep, the tint. Black and dark brown mix it. Okay. So the starter kit. This is the tint, and I will put the website in my description box below. How cute is her packaging? Love it. 
Step one. Your breasts don't look that bad. I thought I was about to come into something looking crazy. The way you text. They're so bad. Like I need them done every two weeks, I think. Mm -hmm. I doing your brows your last pregnancy. That's crazy, right? That's insane. <gasps> mm -hmm. wow. My tint is on, you guys. I was trying to figure out what the f is wrong with your eyebrows. Uh, me? You don't like your eyebrows? I was like, what the f is wrong with I thought you was finna go to a costume party. No, this is my new look. Yeah. You don't like it? I go to Instagram, everybody's wearing their dark, dark brows. Yeah. I just got out of Instagram, everybody's wearing their dark brows. page. I'm kind of feeling it. I think so that this is gonna be. Is that on your eyebrows? Bitch. <laughs> Tint. Tint. Want some? Thank you, Candy. My head looks so weird. Like, I had braids in, my weave in, now I have my natural hair and I feel like my head looks so big. No, it doesn't. Doesn't it look big? You know what I want to do? After I have the baby, I want to go to Turkey and I want to get a new hairline. I just found this guy. I think that's where he is and he's so cool. Yeah. Yes. I need one because I have a really big forehead. Me too. Like, my forehead is huge for no reason. Yeah, mine is like, I think mine's receding. <laughs> hey, hunties. So, hold up. Before I get into what Shanae is talking about, um, I tried these Kiss Press On Falsies because of Shanae. Okay? Shanae, why does everyone live on TikTok? Anyways, Shanae discovered these on TikTok and she got a pair and she got a pack for her vacation. And I'm like, pick some up for me too because she was raving about them. I ripped them off, but let me show you how they go on just in case you guys want to get some kiss press on lashes. So I got the medium and long length. So I'm just putting, so I'm just gonna go ahead and show you how you put it on. So you take the applicator, the kiss applicator, and you put the lash underneath your lash line. Oh my gosh. Like this. Like that. Oh God. And then you squeeze it together like so. No glue needed. They say it lasts a week. Does it? No, it's 24 hours. No, they said we've done They're liars on TikTok. <laughs> They lie. <laughs> They're getting that money, honey. They be tricking the people. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so. That's their hook too, to like bring people in. Do you want lashes that last a week? Yeah, no, this lasts one minute. Cause I pulled them all out. But don't be like me. I think it could, it can last 24 hours if you don't pull them out like me, but I, my eyes get irritated with lashes. Okay, 
So I'll just put it underneath your lash line and squeeze it together like that. Did you try this? No. So you convinced me to waste my money? No, I was going to try it on my shirt. Lord. So why did you hype me up to get these? Because I just wanted you to try them first. What do you think? Honest. What are your thoughts so far? Just looking at you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it's pretty easy. Yeah, I it's, think I could do this. it's pretty easy. You want to try? I was about to do a whole lash appointment. And I found these on TikTok. No, do the lash appointment. You're going out of town. You don't want to worry about your lashes and face makeup and yeah, all that. I think I want to do this. Okay, where's your time? Where's your time? So, what they say, Shanae? Um, yeah. So, I was... What was I doing? I think I was watching your last vlog. Or the one before that to get caught up. Now, it's just reading the comments per usual. Mm -hmm. And someone was like, you need to tell your assistant to take that wig off of her head. Because <laughs> that color doesn't fit her. And I just wanted to respond back to that. Hunty, this is not real here. Right. Okay, this is no wig. <laughs> you know, like... <laughs> do y'all think before you comment something? People just want to say. How do you assume this is a wig? You've never seen a black person with long hair before. That's so now, funny. That's so weird to me. Like, I just had to catch myself for not commenting. So, what would you have said? I was going to say, oh, these are real inches, doll. <laughs> And then put the little emoji where it's showing your nails. Yeah, yeah, period. Yeah. Okay. I was going to put that, but I was like, you know what? It's not worth it. So how do you feel about people commenting negatively? I mean, I feel like as an influencer, like in your position, mm -hmm. sometimes you have to respond back, you know? Mm -hmm. Because it's like people just think they can talk to you any type of way. Yeah. But at the end of the day, that's your brand. Mm -hmm. So you have to be conscious of what you on the internet. Right. Oh, another thing I was going to say is um, I've gotten paid by two brands for this hair color. is a part of her image a baby bump is a part of mine <laughs> right that's all y'all want from me babies and i'm here for it and you're fine with attending meetings right for the um adoption stuff yeah so, yeah yeah what are you doing me just putting on my lash <laughs> look at this little boomerang that shanae did I like that. All right, you guys, let's go upstairs and clean the closet. Yeah. yeah. Girl, it's so claustrophobic in here. It's so small. Like, I can't deal. But you know what? This is my post divorce house. And I feel like everything I've outgrown. I've outgrown this space. Yeah. But I mean, like, I don't know if I feel like moving right now. The kids, you know what Samia said? She's like, um, mom, we need a bigger house. And then, <laughs> and then Zane, he showed me a house on Roblox. He was like, mom, when are we gonna move into a bigger house? <laughs> I was so scared for the longest time to, to branch out look, just, like, move. to move, because I just feel like when I was married for over nine years, like, I was taken care of, you know? Yeah. 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 I really was. And you scared because you have to do all this by yourself. And I do everything by myself. You know, well not everything anymore, but I was in the beginning. And I feel like a part of me is scared to leave. Because I'm so comfortable. What? It's time. We need to break down this freaking wall <laughs> and make more space. Wait, so you'd rather do that? Just break this down? Build onto this home? Like, there's just always something going on. I know. 
You know what I'm saying? Life is always changing and it's so hard to get comfortable. And now I have to explore the idea of expanding my space because we have a baby on the way and we might be adopting. The family is growing. We can't. That's the girl. Just thought about what? Your car. What about my car? Move into it? One, two, three, four. No, there's gonna be five. Okay. Samia, so Zayn, Aya, baby, and the next one. Five. Okay. That life is gonna change. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of people. <sighs> but you got this. Five I'm not kids. saying it's bad, but I'm just saying, like, I don't want you to be uncomfortable, you know? We need more space. Yeah. You want to get rid of anything in here? Shh. Um, or just organize. We need more space. <laughs> Girls, where are we going to move? I don't know. Should we move out of the state? You really want to move? Mm -hmm. Like, out of Atlanta? I'm, well, I, can, I can explore the idea. Where would you go? No, really, where would you go? Nowhere. I don't like anywhere else. I thought you said LA. I mean, I lived in LA. Everyone's just chasing the dream. And I'm not there, I just want to be a mom. Yeah. Demon and thing, you know? Demon and thing out there. It. Yeah. I don't want to be near none of them duppy thing. Mm -mm. You know what duppy them? No. Duppy. What is that? Ghosts and spirits and thing. So you call it duppy? Duppy. You should know, ask your boyfriend. I'm going to ask him. He be saying all types of crazy <laughs> Child. Well, a bad child. Yeah, Dutty Pitney. So like he's he, nasty and stink. What did the dog do? Pee in the house? No, she's trained. Mm -hmm. So what did Dutty Pitney do? She's run everywhere. She's hyper. <laughs> he said Dutty Pitney. Pitney. <laughs> I'm like, oh my god. She's speaking pat to the dog. That is so funny. What he said? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to get this vlog on you. The yeah, girl, he's been talking to Willow and Patala, and I'm like, oh my god. He she talks to the Dutchy dog, and. <laughs> like, she does not understand that. That is so funny. Girl. So, you understand what he's saying? Sometimes. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I'm just like, wait, what are you saying? What are you talking about? You should speak in. You should speak Patua back to him. Girl, I can't. It sounds. It doesn't sound the same. Okay, say some words. I. That's all I know is Dutty Pick Me. <laughs> Dutty Pick Me. Du Dutty Pick Me. Wagwan. Wagwan, yeah. Um. Why's his dad? His dad be saying scammer. Scammer. <laughs> yes. Like calling people a scammer. Yeah. <laughs> what else? <laughs> he called his cousin that. I know. What about the Dutty Fee? <laughs> no. Dutty Fee. That was a, don't get us started. <laughs> oh my god. Not okay. Stop. What the heck is this? Whose top is this? Samia's. That is not Samia's. Samia wouldn't wear this. This is French connection. This is Canadian. So this must be. That's yours? Don't disrespect me like that. Oh, oh no, I wasn't trying to. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't trying to. Do you to. want it? No, girl. That's Okay, this she, stuff is cute though. That's, here. that's real cute. You know you're not wearing this. What's wrong with that? Dirty skirt. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Latoya, you have to find a fan. Go and get a dirty fan from Walmart, yes? Mm -hmm. Look. She's everything. I need to sell this on Poshmark. Show them. If you guys want to buy this dress, it's from House of CB. We'll give you a little discount. Yes, we will. It's on sale right now. By on the time you see this vlog, it will be already posted. Yes, on <laughs> Poshmark. And this, and this. Well, this is cute. I love that. I can't believe we didn't sell this already. I know, we didn't even put it on the site yet. Oh my god, you should go home to your man in this. But these are your colors. <laughs> That's Jamaican things, yo. <laughs> <laughs>
so you can put your iPads in there and watch a movie? Yes. I love, you know what my favorite part of the fort is? What? The lights. Yes. Mommy, there's another section, you wanna see it? The lights are so cool. Oh, yeah. So there's like the bed section and the couch section, but there's another section. We're gonna come. We're gonna That's come. a massive fort. Oh, that's so cool. Now, are you guys under a sofa? No. Oh. <laughs> I love your fort, you guys. You guys can have a disco party in the fort. Y'all watch this. Ouch. I'm trying to get out. Y'all watch this. <laughs> Did great. I'm excited to see you guys on your own playing mass. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Okay, bye. Y'all be good. Okay. I got the plug, I made the call for me I'm talking late night for ya Let me lay a great time on ya Don't hesitate, no, don't you Just say you will Will You want me to have a huggy? Yeah Give me hugs I love you, mommy I love you too, baby How much do you love mom? Uh, two more. <laughs> two more only? Yeah. How come not ten more? Because I love you really much. I love this you too. is like Christmas. What's that? Oh, I don't know. Can we not make a mess, please? Aya asked me every day what I'm having. She's like, boy or girl? Boy or girl, mom? 
boy or girl? Then she was like, I think it's a girl. Then she's like, what do you think it is, mom? I'm like, I don't know. She's like, well, I think it's a girl. But boy or girl? Anyways, so... So Slick knows get the gender. Out my room. Excuse me? Want me to get out of your room? Okay, I'll go to Zane's room. No. Right. Stay. Okay, exactly. <laughs> okay, so two three knows the gender of the baby. Mommy, this is your baby. This is my baby? Yeah. <laughs> so anyways, the nurse. So we called the nurse just to get my blood work results back for myself and the baby. Everything is perfectly fine so far, which I am so thankful for. That's really all I care about is to have a healthy pregnancy journey and a healthy baby. And she asks us if we wanna know the gender. I said no because I think I want to have a gender reveal. I don't know. I, I'm not sure what I want. I just don't want to know the gender yet. I don't know what it is. Anyways, Slick was like, pass me the phone, pass me the phone. So he puts the phone on mute and he was like, I want to know the gender of the baby. So they told him the gender. I keep trying to figure out the gender asking him <laughs> different questions like should we get him some onesies or should we get her like a pink stroller or something like that but he's not giving in he knows exactly what he's doing i think one time he did slip up he said he and then he said her so I'm like, is it a boy or is it a girl? And then he started playing around. So I just got so confused. Anyways, he knows the gender. I don't know. And I don't want to know. I think I just want to have a gender reveal. What do you guys think? And if I don't have a gender reveal, I'm just going to try to get Slick to tell me. I mean, I know they could call the nurse and be like, hey nurse, what am I having? But... I don't know why I'm not doing it. Why do I want to be surprised? Why? <laughs> I don't know why. All I know is I don't want to know right now. I don't know. I just don't want to know right now. So I'm going to continue to wait. And we can continue to guess. Anyways, thank you so much for watching today's vlog. Mommy. If you guys enjoyed it. Yes, baby? Mommy, look at this. Mommy, I want to use it. Okay, hold on, Lucy. Okay? I don't want it. You can wait. Can you wait? Aya? I like that. Mom, I want to put that in the bathtub. Oh, absolutely not. Okay. You're going to make a mess. You can go to the pool with it. Okay. Okay, so we're about to put Aya's mermaid tail on. There you go. Yeah, it will work right now. <laughs> <laughs> I is a mermaid. Yeah. <laughs> I said, watch. Say thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Say subscribe to our channel. I can't walk. You can't walk? Anyways, you guys, I'm about to give Ow. Aya a bath and then I'm going to bed. I'm so tired. Thank you so much for your support, watching, liking the video, commenting. You guys are truly amazing and I'm just excited to continue this pregnancy journey with my online family, my hunties. Anyways, I'll see you in the next vlog. I'm out of breath. Bye guys. Bye guys. I'm thinking about posting more vlogs per week. We'll see. Um, yeah, so bye. <laughs> bye guys. Bye guys. Bye in the channel. Bye in the channel, some mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. From the first day I met you, I knew you were special.